I'm bored. I'm bored. I'm bored. I'm bored. I'm bored. I am bored. I'm bored. Two hours later. Get down, man! You may be wondering why I've just come out of a bush round. But we are under attack. We are under attack for a wild creature named the Frederick Meister. You can see we are under attack by a wild animal called Frederick. Frederick! Where are you, Frederick? He's not buying it. Let's go scope out the area, shall we? What are you going to do to save yourself, huh? What are you going to save yourself? Nothing. Enemy. What do you think, Fred? He's very scared. Alright, I've got him. Have you ever wanted to go fishing, but you, you couldn't go to the beach or the river? I have the next best bet if you want to go fishing at home. Right. The first thing you need is a stick. We need to go find a stick that is perfect for fishing, alright? We'll go find it. Alrighty, so I have found my stick. This stick is perfect what I need it for. So now we just got to go find the next part of our fishing equipment. So the next thing we need for our fishing equipment is we've got the stick, obviously, so you know, it's pretty durable. We now need String. We need some string that we're going to connect to our fishing fishing rod. Something like that much. Can't really see it. Can you see that? Kinda. Yeah. So it's pretty long. <coughs> pretty long. So we'll take that. Big piece of string. We've got some sticky tape. Thank you. Onto our fishing rod, like so. If I haven't seen a fishing rod, this is just superb. You can't really even see the string, it's not that um, thick. But it is so sturdy, it'll be so st Whoop, don't want to get caught in a rod like a normal rod. Oh my god, don't get caught! For what we want to catch, this is going to be a, such a good, good fishing rod. It's better than any scissor or anyone else's fishing rod, right? Let's go catch some fish with it, shall we? Stop getting connected! Oh! What a great day for a fish. I am so keen to go catch my very first fish of the day. Got my tackle box, got my fishing rod and my fishing uh, catcher thingy. We're off to a good start boys. Let's go catch that big fish, shall we? So this is the watering hole that we'll be catching our fish. You can't see it right now, but currently there is loads of little fishies deep in down the ocean down there. It is very... Ow! Fuck, I nearly broke my own fishing rod, but it's very scary. It's got some scary fish in there. We're gonna go fish in there. I'm going to see if we can go catch something. First thing we're going to do is have to um, bait up our fishing rod, isn't it? Luke? So we're going to have to use one of these massive hooks. Um, they, are, they are pretty strong, I'll tell you. They're pretty strong hooks. One hook, one hook, one fishing rod. Ow. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at this. Look at that. We've got a connector, boys. We have a fishing line. I reckon it's time to go for our fish. So the type of fish we're going in um, this lake is these things called a um, bear fish. They're pretty rare kind of fish. You can only find them in certain lakes and stuff like that. So you know, you have to use a pretty long, um, sturdy line. Um, and it's going to take a while. We're going to be here for a while. It's going to be a pretty gnarly experience. Um, but yeah, we'll see how we go, shall we boys? But yeah, yeah, no, like the weather's pretty nice in here, it's just, you know, no clouds in sight, it's just, you know, <laughs> get it, no clouds in sight, inside, uh, caught a snapper before, but you know, who wants snapper when you can get bear, bear fish? Ooh, boys, boys, we might be on, hold up, we might be on. Boys, it broke, it's broke the line. But he's still in here, he's still swimming around in here, he's still swimming around in here. We'll get him, we'll get him. We've got the trusty old hand net. Hand net's coming in hard. Ah, can we get him? Mm -hmm. Oh, we got. Boys, we. 
Oh. oh my god, boys. Oh my god. We have caught a wild bear. Holy cow, we caught a wild bear in its natural habitat. We caught a bear, boys. Look at that thing. Look how big it is. It's the biggest, biggest <coughs> bear fish I've ever seen. He must be around. Oh, it must be like 40 centimeters. He must be like 40 centimeters, this bad boy. He is very wet, but I've, 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 I've already killed him. I've already killed him, boys. So, like, we'll be able to cook him up for dinner. This be a good dinner for the fam. Um, I'm going to dry him off and we'll go, you know, fill him and stuff like that. So, it'll be, it'll be, it'll be, it'll be good, okay? It's a, it's a good catch for you. But, boys, I think it's been a successful day. We've caught ourselves a big ass fish, big bear fish, and I think it's time that we cook this bad boy up. On the barbecue. I'm thinking the barbecue will be perfect for this little bad boy. So we're just gonna give him a bit of a cook. Really enjoy what we have cooked here. We've cooked ourselves a big ass fish on the barbie. Look at that. Mm. It's gonna be oh look at that. Look at the pan mark. It's just phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal berry. But that's gonna do it, I think. We've um caught our fish for the day. Um, it's been very eventful, very eventful, very eventful catching the fish. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah, this has been your boy Rarest Baza, aka Cab Thompson. I'll see you guys soon.